okay hey guys welcome yeah. to the another video and this is how this is every video Hey guys, welcome to another video. So it's a Wednesday, so अभी it like college related video होगा. And in this video, we have a great friend of mine. Like he was the one who taught me in my first year. Like बहुत सारे courses and so he's he's more he's more than a friend. He was like he's my teacher too. And like I learned so much from him. Uh, Madan Vyas Guruji. Okay, his name is his name is Guru. Okay, so Madan Vyas Guru. Hi Madan, you can unmute yourself. and yeah introduce yourself bro <clears throat> yeah so my name is madan i am currently a second year student in bitco and i am studying in ec for now so yeah also madan tell us about your cgpa bro i mean that's what okay, the okay so is. my first year cgpa is 9.49 i got 9.31 in sem 1 and 9.62 in sem 2 which is bro and like guys If you are a college student, you know how hard it is to get an even a nine plus CGPA, and this guy is like nine point five plus. So, and he also might get get a vert, vertical transfer to CS, which is like super super tough. So yeah, Madan, without further ado, let's get started. So, why do you study so much, bro? This is the first question. Why do you study so much? What's the motivation? So okay, so what I strictly believe is I do not study all that much. The reason I tend to get these results is because I just manage to stay consistent. It's not about bursts of studying where I just study so much more than the others. Just being consistent throughout the sem and doing your work pro- properly, not having any backlogs. So why do I do it? it I guess it's just uh, it is just the same day mentality, right? Like I just used to do my do the stuff which was assigned to me, and I used to go to class. So I just I just continued what I was doing there, and uh, that's what gave me these results. Oh, bro! Great, great, great. So, how often do you maintain those concepts? Do you cover up things weekly or daily, or how how frequent? I never studied daily or even like consistently weekly. So, what I used to do was I used to attend all my classes. So, if so, my philosophy was that if you are weak in a subject, just attend all the classes, go to all the tutorials, go to all the lectures, make sure that you are uh, always updated in the subject and you don't have any backlogs. So. and for the especially in first sem you in first sem first year you'll see that uh, you have chemistry and biology right like for me i felt that those subjects were kind of easy so i didn't give much attention to them so i just went for the subject which i found hard which was max and props that so i used to attend every class of max every class of props that and uh, every time i used to have a quiz or a test i used to start studying like a few days earlier like instead of just the day before and uh, that's that's how i used to tackle most of my exams in the first year is in college okay like if, so there are a lot of activities happening like so kudhar ko chala yeah. something is happening at every corner of college so how do you manage and i know for a reason that you are like involved in badminton and you play a lot too and you chill with obviously me and friends so how do you manage extra curricular activities along with uh, studies and like how how does that go yeah. so okay so in my case at least uh my studies never interrupted any of my extra curricular activities at all like i never had a situation where i had to cancel something because i had to study or something like ex- except in the cases where when it was the day just before a test or just before a midterm other, other than those cases i just went for all the activities that i could did everything that i could it's mainly because i attended most of the classes that i needed to do and i did not have any backlog so in case so i said that i didn't attend the biology or chemistry classes for the most part right so if i didn't attend those classes what i used to do was i used to uh, at the end of the week i used to just go through the chapters which i missed or just to make sure that i am not uh, accumulating a lot of chapters which i have to study right before the exams okay so like even if you missed the class you kind of covered it up on your own and went for the next class and like okay so yeah. don't get so, off the track yeah and mm-hmm. if if you are finding it difficult to like study on your own i just recommend to just attend all your lectures and especially for the subjects which you are finding it difficult right now just attend the lectures uh, uh, and if you stay consistent i don't think you'll have to put in a lot of extra effort on your own time okay so like that is the strategy of like studying for you right yeah and it's it, uh, and again i can't uh, guarantee that whatever i did is going to work for you too so If you have a system which is working for you, go with it. Else, give this a try. Okay, bro. So, what other kind of? Okay, so this is a very like, spontaneous question. Okay, so what other systems do you think that toppers use? Like people whom you interact with, like there would be people with the same CG. That what are, do you think everyone does the same thing that you are doing, or 
what exactly okay, uh, no i don't i don't think that everyone does the same so i have a friend too who got I, his name is shushank he got 9.97 in like the first year and uh, if you go and ask him what he did he'd probably say that like he i don't think he was involved in many extracurricular activities like he was he was there in many clubs but uh, he used to attend them but even then he used to study daily like at the end of uh, every class he used to go and revise his chapter back in his hostel room he used to revise at the end of every week before quizzes mm-hmm. he used to do many papers so he was uh, like that amount of effort will obviously give you better results but i don't think it's necessary if you want to enjoy your college life also okay fine so how not to get distracted Oh, well, I'm talking about every single distraction list, like starting from smaller distractions like club, club or department activities, and to engaging in uh, obviously other kinds of distractions. So how how did you like? Where okay, so he, I have to stop at this point, and I have to devote this time to studying and something like that. Okay, so first of all, do not consider your club activities as distractions. Like, try to put in as much time as uh, possible for the clubs and activities which you like. and uh, when it comes to other distractions like uh, watching netflix or gaming or something try to limit it just before exams like when when uh, you have exam times or when you when uh, the exam season is nearing try to reduce them a bit and think about think about how much effort you'll have to put in for a specific subject so that uh, you are confident about that subject before a few days uh, within a few days of the exam so that uh, you don't accidentally uh, waste a lot of time right before exams have have a well laid out schedule just before exam so that uh, you 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 space your time out evenly and that you don't uh, de- dive deep into any of the other distractions okay madan so i think that's it for this video so if you want like i if i have missed any of the questions we would like to take that or any tips or suggestions for your younger versions nah just have fun bro that's it <laughs> Hello everyone my name is Manvi Asguru I am a second year in Bits Goa and uh, I am currently in AC <laughs> Hey what's wrong the way you laughing bro chill, chill keep on going Do you want me to do it again I'll do it no, again what do you want yeah, me to say no 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 what do you want me to say No 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 bro it's fine say, 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 say what do you want me to say say what do you want me to say no say what do you want me to You're talking Get uh, <laughs> this bubble cup start yeah talk Start what ask questions no what do you want me to say Hi mother introduce yourself Okay, one minute.